New stuff is here. Oh, let's go, let's go. Let's go, oh, let's go, let's go. Two seventy-five, thirty, nineteens, Lexanis. I think these will be perfect. Pretty excited about these. Let's go find out. telling you about all things drift maintenance and repair shop but they deal in a lot of drifting as you can see kind of their thing kill tires the whole nine there's Supra just hanging out this is Stancy car heaven drift car heaven this is these guys are the greatest next door is JDM hookup they got all JDM stuff, they got old engines, they got old parts, they got everything in there. Which is that big barn right there. These guys are in St. Charles, Missouri. If for whatever reason somebody watching this, local to these guys, or if you're passing through and you want something done, hit these guys up. They're pretty busy though, call in advance, try to get an appointment in, but these guys aren't telling me to say any of this. I just really appreciate these guys taking care of me. They always do, they always have, they always probably will. So yeah, I mean, here we are. We'll see how these tires go. Numbers on my phone, they keep calling me, calling me. Girlies at my shows, why they all on me? I don't want them no, get them all off me, all on me. Say say that for hell, she a cause, she a cause. Four cars deep, we'll come through on a late night. Chicken spot, wings and fries, we call that a day night. Lights on, so out, I don't have no stage fright. Knew that I was built for this forever, ever, ever. All my friends, we ride beamers, we ride bands, ten times ten. All my friends, this for real, till the end. Ten times ten. All my friends, we ride beamers, we ride bands, ten times ten. All my friends, this for real, till the end. Circle small can't let too many close to me. Love my brodies, they all hit the road. With me. We get to that bag, now talking groceries. The blood is thin when you can bear it up to loyalty. Five steps back, never panic, no, we stay right. Count that stack, I know I will always make mine. Real long nights, I've been working, no, it takes time. Knew that I was built for this forever. No, he only has so many cars. I did see that one. That's not gonna work. Hopefully it stretches a little more. All right, so they don't quite fit how I want them to, but we're gonna run them, see what happens. Worst thing that can happen is I just take them off and I try something else. We're stretching tires this way. Uh, some of you may know, it's like called Sudani, where the lip is exposed and it's seated on the barrel. With this stretch, a lot of the times it'll seat itself after you mount the tires and you actually drive for a little bit. It's pretty close to what I want. I'm hoping it's gonna work. Uh, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna drive on them a little bit, see if they work, if not, they'll de-bead or they just don't work. But so far, if you like what you're seeing in the video, then two 75, 30, 19s work on a 13. That's what these are. That's what they look like. I'm not too stoked about it yet, but it changes over time. So we'll see and uh, we'll just go from there. So let's get these back on the car, put the car down and we'll see what happens. Here's 
true test. Call it the air out test. Because I'm gonna air out. And see what rubs. See what hits. See what happens. Set you guys up. We'll see what happens. Fingers crossed. check it out that last clip ended kind of abruptly I didn't make an outro to it because I wasn't sure how I was feeling about the tires yet I wanted to give you guys a fair shake and understanding how I felt and what these guys and these tires would do and how they actually seated so I actually stopped the clip and I went and drove for a while wound up driving it for a little while over the weekend and then went to work for a couple days and I'm filming this outro now just to give you guys a complete result of how these turned out and honestly it sounded like in those earlier clips that I don't like them but I'm kind of falling in love with them some of you may have seen on Instagram by now I've taken it out and taken pictures and uploaded them to Instagram I think they I think they fit pretty good in my opinion this is my opinion solely my opinion but if you guys like what you're seeing I'm telling you what it took to get it so with that being said this is the fitment I'm actually pretty impressed with it. I'm really enjoying how it's feeling while I drive. Uh, I don't really hit anything anymore. This tire used to rub really bad right in here. It used to rub right here really bad when I hit bumps. It only sits on that now. It's good there. I come around to this side, it's the same thing. But, I mean, you guys can see it's pretty tight. It's pretty fitted. It's pretty much exactly what I wanted. So that was the reason for me not putting an outro to that last clip and kind of ending it abruptly. I know I've shaved since, kind of making this a weird time frame of a video, but like I said, I wanted to make sure that I put some miles on the tires and they actually seeded and found their true home. And uh, with that, being able to honestly review the new tires for you guys. So on a 19 by 13 inch wide wheel, I'd say if you want the exact same fitment I have, a 275 30 19 is definitely where you're going to be. But it does come with the sacrifice of always worrying about Sudani stretch. Sudani can de beat anytime, air out anytime, blow out anytime, all the above. It can do any of that. You always, always, always have to be on your P's and Q's with Sudani stretch. It's a bit of a pain in the butt, but it makes everything look cool to me, my opinion again. And I think it gives these SN95s new edge. I get attacked. New edges. Good fitment in the rear if you guys decide to go with an IRS swap. Get a little camber on there and want to be as fitted as, you, as you've seen in the video. So with that being said, I just wanted to make sure that you guys understand why it looks like a new day. It is a new day. Shaved. Completely new. Everything's new. But I wanted to make sure that I gave an honest review, gave my honest opinion, and showed you guys honest results on what happens when you put a 275 30 19 on a 13 inch wide wheel the results speak for themselves the results show for themselves i appreciate you guys watching man i'm trying to stay con consistent with this uploading schedule i'm trying to go for every friday make a new video every weekend upload it the next friday so far it's working but i think i've only done two videos in a row so don't hold me to it but again i'm going to try to keep it consistent for you guys and hopefully i land on some topics that you guys are enjoying and uh maybe upload enough videos that anybody can watch whatever they want and find something they enjoy and watch one or two or three or four videos that i may upload and that would mean the world to me man eventually i'd like like i said in the intro to make my face known enough to this car specifically that if anybody has any questions at a show out and about if you notice me whatever and you have questions about this car you know it's my car we can get to know each other we can have a conversation and Hopefully I can give you some information that you didn't have or couldn't find on the internet. That'd be awesome to me. That's what I do this for. That's what I love. So all that being said, wrapped up in a nutshell, I appreciate you guys and I'm out. Peace.